from ride hailing to helicopters and now to bikes, Uber continues to expand its footprint on the future of transportation. Yesterday, the company reportedly acquired Brooklyn based Jump Bikes for a whopping $200 million. This is to us a real story about how these companies can grow in New York. Jump is a bike sharing company that currently serves just a few cities, including San Francisco. Although their smart bikes, which include GPS and electric assistance, can be found in 40 other markets under different names. Like Uber, Jump hopes to improve the future of transportation by reducing the number of cars on the road. Combining Jump's track record of product innovation and city partnerships with Uber's scale, operational excellence and resources will allow us to make a global impact faster than if we were to pursue our vision alone, the company CEO said on the website. Ultimately, Julie Samuels at Tech NYC says the deal could have a big impact on the future of transportation technology startups in New York City. When you've got access to really interesting places like the Navy Yard in Brooklyn, you can build really interesting things. And so I think yesterday's sale really showed us that this stuff is happening in New York, it's going to continue to happen in New York, and it sends an important signal to future entrepreneurs that you can build this here in New York. Unlike city bikes, which require a docking station like this, the Jump e-bikes can attach to any public bike rack. And even though they're yet to launch in New York City, Samuels says it's only a matter of time. The city right now is doing some planning and some kind of investigating into dockless bikes, um, as opposed to you already see city bikes everywhere that are docked. Would you would you that use would that? Be convenient if I wanted to go someplace for a short time that's not that doesn't have a rack. The deal comes just a week after Mayor De Blasio eased restrictions on electric bikes in New York City. But city bike customer Adam J says he'll stick to his own pedal power, whether he picks up an e-bike or an old-fashioned one. Part of the advantage is getting keeping in shape. <laughs>